so far, I've seen a lot of dead storm cloaks and no dead Imperials, which is really good for our side. It's just also a little... Ooh! Commander's Qua... I'm just... No, just in, just in case... The commander's in there cowering. Not, me, not that a good commander would do that. No commander cowers whilst his men are being slaughtered. No! He stands behind them, making lots of noise and not getting shot. Taking the pale gives us another port in Dawnstar and puts us within striking distance of Windhelm. That should make Ulfric a bit more cautious, huh? Absolutely. Battles are won by trained and disciplined men. Wars are won by talented and exceptional individuals. I'm raising you to Prefect. Take this blade as a gift and symbol of your new Prefect? Rank. You've earned it. Okay. Right. Um, yes. Do I have any new orders? Make your way to our camp in the Rift. We have a few surprises for the Stormcloaks lined up. The Rift, you say? Yeah, uh, yes. No problem. For the Emperor. Yes, for the Emperor. Um, right. Okay, I am now a Prefect. Why does that make me feel like I've been made like a senior student at a college? The Imperial camp in the Rift really is on the edge of the Rift. In fact, it's closer to Whiterun than Riften. I was thinking I would pop into Riften and, um, you know, return a few of the tasks I've done. However, that's quite far from here. Probably the easiest thing to do is take the carriage to Falkreath, run from Falkreath to Lakeview Manor, then take the carriage to Everstead. However, I think I'd like to return to Latoria and see what she's discovered. And I could do that by going to Whiterun. Possibly... I've got some things to do in Whiterun as well, but I would, I would like to see if they've cleaned it up a little bit. Then perhaps go see Latoria and then just travel over here. I think, you know, just... Need a ride? Kill five or six birds with one stone, so to speak. Where do you want to go? I want to go to White Run. Climb and back and we'll be off. And yes, honestly, a big part of it is I want to see if it's Get up there. like still burning and check my house is not burning. Okay. So far, so normal. That's... That's kind of different, isn't it? Bit of a mess. I tell you what, let's take the horses to, uh, to the gate. It's not at all because I'm so lazy I can't be bothered walking up here. It's because... When we leave, we'll want the horses. Okay, there's still a bit of a mess. Yeah, little bit of a mess. Not total. I wonder where he's going. <laughs> War just doesn't get in the way of that kind of thing, does it? In fact, sometimes it uh, has... Okay, my. If I'd been on guard at the Thalmor embassy, would nobody be disturbing that party? Want a bet? Okay, my house seems to be fine. Everything seems to be intact on the outside. Are we? Are we good on the inside? Very. So glad you're okay. Just we just we were totally worried that you you'd been hurt in the battle, so we came rushing back eventually to check on you. Out of curiosity, why is there a dead body outside of my house? 
Well, it's not technically outside of my house, but it's close enough. Can we... Let's just put it over here, maybe. And okay, that's better. Yeah. Okay. That. Okay. So we're not. We've not fixed everything yet. Although this doesn't look too bad. Okay, it could be worse. It could be worse. It is a little worse. It's... Okay. Whose house is that? Apparently it's marked for uh, being robbed. Uh, our... Where's the... Did the priest die in the attack? Oliver! By Sithis, but you are a persistent one. Haven't I told you enough? No, I just want to know, is, he, is, it, is, this, is this poor priest dead? Because that would be terrible. That would be absolutely terrible. Yes, it would. We'd all be very, very sad. Yes, we would. All right, so this looks... This looks okay. Oh, I was actually going to check in with Barangar and see what he had for sale, I think. Yeah, that rings a bell. So... And the Jarl's not here, or he's still in bed, or he's upstairs continuing on with the war plans? Yes, there he is! Hello, I thought I'd check in, say hi. See how the rebuilding is going. There's a house uh, down towards the, uh, the, the close to the gate. Um, it would be great if you could fix it. It has Preventus, absolutely. You must help me. We need to convince my brother to do more for the war. It's help. nothing to do with the fact that what it spoils the view. Do, it's just me being a concerned is a citizen. You know I can't question his judgment. Okay. I'm, not I'm just going to ignore those two. See you. Uh, okay, never mind. That's it. Anyway, uh, so if you could bear in mind what what I asked about the um the house, it's just it is unfortunately a bit of an eyesore. Not for me. Not for me. I don't mind. I'm just saying for everyone else. It's uh, it's it's hurting morale. Yeah. Farangar. Come to Dragon's Reach to discuss the ongoing hostilities, like the rest of the great warriors. No. Do, why do you ask me that? It's like I didn't go off and get a dragon stone for you, or, you know, fight a dragon, or, you know, help defend Whiterun, or perhaps the fact that I'm the thing. You know, all these other things. Why are you always asking me, why am I here? I'm here to actually see what you've got for sale, believe it or Take not. Sometimes you are a little bit annoying. Fool's Ebony Volume 5. Don't mind if I do. No paintings, though. Oh, well, still, still. Do come back. A new book. Always welcome. Right. There is one last thing to do whilst we're here. This is normally the sort of thing I would do at night, but, um... Shiny trinket. <laughs> Whistle if you need me, okay? Let me just check around. Annoying child. Isolde does not seem to be here. Okay. Do I not have a key? Do I not have a key? Alright, I've got to plant a gem. Why have there even been here? It's probably here, isn't it? Um, what was it? It was... Not that one. It was not that one. It was... Was it that one? No. What was I supposed to be? It was... I've got something that I'm supposed to be planting. Some Something that's stolen. Oh, God. I should check this before I come running through the damned door. Um, stolen ten carat onyx. Okay. Stolen ten 
I saw, I saw <clears throat> that one stolen. Okay, that looks like the sort of thing that's going to have a place in the museum. Yeah, I don't think I've ever been here. I must have, like, skipped a few places when I uh, last sweet rolled this place. I can't think why I did that. Probably because it's a small, insignificant-looking house off to the side. And I should probably use this as a learning experience because, as we've just seen, I think occasionally there are some little gems hidden in such places. Did I really not take those coins? Dear, oh dear, I'm so out of practice. Okay. And we are done. Okay. Okay, where are we going now? Well, we're off to see Latoria, but there is actually one more... No problem. I've not been here either. Moving. Okay. Did I hear footsteps? No. Oh. I told you to... I told you to stay outside. I told you to stay outside. I did. Okay, look. Seriously, dude. You better not attack anyone. If they come walking in, I'm gonna go invisible. And the last thing I need is you... ...viciously stabbing them. Maybe I should do this another time. I don't, you know what, you're making me nervous. I just wanted to double check there wasn't some really obvious thing. <sighs> okay. No, there is one other thing that we've got to do for the guild on the way to Latorias. It's just something in a manner that we need to pick up. <sighs> you're not supposed to... Why do you have your mouth open again? Stop that. Uh -huh. That really does freak me out a little. Whiteron has some of the best air in Skyrim. There is a subtle dog breath aftertaste, though. Right, then you should close your mouth so you don't get What's it. What's next? In there, right? I need to be a little more cautious. I, I think perhaps being the thane of Whiterun and having invisibility potions galore has made me a little cocky. We could have got caught in that last building very, very easily. And with you there, you never know how badly that could end up. I do wonder if this means I should not... Well, you know what? I'm a Thane. I'm a Thane calling on one of the, um... The... The farms. That's perfectly normal. I will be here. Perfectly normal behaviour. Yes, it is. Perfectly normal behaviour. I'm just doing my thanely duty. I'm calling in on people. And, um... It wasn't there. No, it was... Was it this one? Yes, this is what I'm doing. I'm checking... I'm checking the farmsteads. I'm just... Uh, I'm checking the wall. And things. I should probably be doing this during the night. Okay, there's no guard coming. Oh. You know what? I'm sure I'll be in Whiterun at some future point. I don't need to get everything done at once. It's a very strange compulsion I have, but I can ignore it. I can absolutely ignore it and wait till I'm next passing at night, like a sensible person. Yes, indeed. That guard is... Oh, God, that's not what I wanted to do. That guard is actually doing quite a wide perimeter sweep, isn't he? He goes all the way to the wall. I mean, it, it, it's, it's good to know that the guards are being very thorough. Yes, it is. And, and, I, and I, I appreciate the fact that they are 
oats. Here you go. Could you, yeah, I'm over here. You could take the horse though. You could take the horse. Take Roach. No, or you could run all the way. I'm sure, right, you know what? You know where I'm going. I am sorry for telling you to wait there. You know where I'm going. I'm going to see Latoria. You will find me, I'm sure. Is that Mace? It's not Ebony, is it? No, oh, it's a vigilant. It's a vigilant. Don't talk to the vigilant. No, no, I think, I think it's, I think it's, Elven. Actually, do not talk to the vigilant. Oh look, a giant rat. Brilliant. Uh, if it follows us, you can kill it when we get there. I'm just going to keep on going. I was about to say it's a nice day, but it actually looks like it. Okay, it looks like it could end up being a fairly miserable day. It's like the the weather hasn't quite made up its mind. Oh, God, really? Is this the rat? Is the rat following me and you're all taking your fists out? At some point in the... Have you any idea how ridiculous you look? Hmm? Get... It's a skeever. Get down, please get down, please get down, please get down. Get down. Thank you. Is everyone else... You're all finished? Very good. See, I'm, I'm wondering whether, like... Okay, I can't even say follow me and then change your gear and give you a weapon, can I? Dragons put you on edge. Well, they put me on edge, but yeah, so I guess they put you on edge. Giant flying lizards that can swallow you whole? No, why would I be on edge? <laughs> I think you, my friend, are the only person who isn't. What? What? Oh yeah, no, me totally blase and calm about dragons. Absolutely. Yeah. Dragons. Piece of cake. What are you on? Have you seen Latoria? I'm I'm looking for Oh, you've got a weapon. Please tell me you actually take it out rather than your fists. Cause could anyone tell me where Latoria is? Is she like I don't know. Doing private stuff. I mean, I don't want to disturb her too much. I'm just... Oh, there's... Was she there the entire time right behind you? Okay. Have you discovered anything interesting? Ah, yes. Latoria did find something interesting. A rare book, in fact. Ooh. Latoria used the press in the museum to make you a copy. Here you are. How did you... So you nipped back to the museum. Could could you get everyone else to do the same thing? Oh, I, I do actually have more books for you, though. I've got more books for you. Could you tell everyone next time? Could you just sort of say, I need help with a book, take them all back to the museum, and warn me in advance so I can come and lock it them all in? Through the day and we are still alive. Well, I hope I can say the same tomorrow. Oh, I was just going to say, what are you doing? Uh, no, I didn't want to do that. See, I've got... You've got me so confused and discombobulated. I forgot I was coming here to collect books. This, um... This, this path that goes through here, it does it go close to the dragons? Is, is there any chance that they might notice us and try and fly out and eat us? Is that a storm cloak? That's... Uh, yeah. And where is... No, there was... Okay, that's that's not where I wanted to go. There's, there's another path yeah. somewhere around here. Is it, is it this? Is this... I suppose technically this is a path? Technically? Uh, actually, it's, it's not too bad. All right. Let's keep our eyes open for dragons. And also our ears open. But let's just keep every single solitary organ we have for sensing things 
on high alert for dragons. And perhaps even a few organs that are not for sensing things on high alert. And no, that was not supposed to be rude. I meant my guts. Yes, I did. And now I know I'm never going to hear the end of that. Okay. You know what? Let's just be very quiet sneaking through this mountain. Somewhere there is an opening. And I suppose this means the dragons could fly out at any moment. Although that could be the way to do this. Get their attention and then ride like the wind to the nearest populated area and, you know, make that particular problem someone else's problem. However, I think we're through. Right. Let's find this Imperial camp. Okay, what on earth do we have here? We're being chased by something. Something magical sounding. Let's just ignore it. There's a troll and a fox. Let's ignore their... Oh, I don't think we can. I think we've got to see... Can we go up there and avoid the troll? I don't... No, that's a dead end. All right, we'll just... Oh, well, the troll's come to play. Right, let's just leave it behind. Leave it. Apparently, the troll's lair has a nern root. I think we should consider that punishment enough. They don't have a trader here, do they? No, I do not believe they do. Right, so we go straight ahead until we come to the T-junction and we take a right. That's not a... That's just a broken tree. So that's not a T-junction. This is a T-junction. So it is somewhere... Over there? But it might be in there. It might actually be in... I think it is. I think we actually have to go... Off the road here. That goes towards Helgen. And... There we are! A nice little hidden camp. What? 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 I'm sorry! Oh, it's, it's, it's a bear. It's a bear. You you can you can join in if you, oh go on yeah join in join in. No, no. Damn! Leave the damned horse alone. What is it with you? God. I was about to say people. I was about to say people because you said they look like people. Is that a legget? Re really? She's. Those rebels think they can best us. They have another thing coming. Did you say another? Okay, never mind. Um. He did, didn't he? He said, if they think Stay they can get the best of us, they have another thing coming rather than than another thought coming. Does that make sense? If they... Th if you think you could best me, you have another thing coming. Now that makes no sense. Does that make sense? Now I'm freaking out. Now, now, now I feel the urge to go to the library and start looking that thing up. Um, right. Liggett. Something to report? Yeah, yeah, I'm, uh, me. The something to report is me. I am reporting for duty. You're going to Riften. My spies report the Jarl steward Anuriel has arrangements with the Thieves' Guild that would be rather embarrassing if made public. I need you to find evidence of her corrupt activities and use it to gain a measure of her cooperation. This will require stealth and discretion. Piece of cake. Jarl's guards won't take kindly to anyone rummaging through her steward's private uh... quarters. 
Fear not. That is, um... Good. I can always count on you, can't I? No, you can. Yes, you can. Just wish you could have told me this before I came all this way, because I could have just gone straight to bloody Riften via the carriage. But no, that's okay. That's fine. That's just, just, I should be happy it's sending us to Riften. I like Riften. I've missed Riften. I miss creeping around Riften and that, oh, it's a bloody rat. I just miss everything about Riften. And apparently we're going there to creep around and then blackmail someone. I mean, it is actually turning out to be a good day. We know who you are, so you'd better come with us right now. Oh God! I don't know who you think I am, and I don't care. Leave me alone. Didn't you get? I don't have time for this foolishness. Now come along quietly, and we won't have to get rough. I was Brother, really I hoping the they were dead. I'm not going anywhere. Or driven I'm off. off I do I'm just... I mean, oh. Good grief. Okay. Now, this is going to seem really, really strange. Hello, little thing. It's just me and my mother at the mill here. My father is gone. We don't know what happened to him. Yeah, I actually do. And for some odd reason, I wrote it into my journal that I should come and tell you and your mother. I don't know why I wrote that into my journal. I can barely even remember when. Can I help you? But I kind of want to scrub it off my journal. Only it's a... What's that? Uh, hello. Here for work? Get an axe and bring me all the wood you can chop. No. I found someone called Lifenar's body. No, it can't be. Oh, my. And all this time I was thinking he'd been unfaithful to me. I feel so stupid. I've been a fool, wasting my time sitting here helpless when I could have sent help sooner. Perhaps this is all my doing. Possibly. What's done is done. Here, I want you to have this. Bringing me closure was kind of you. Yes, it was. It was totally about the the, the iron mace and iron. Mace. It was totally about Goodbye, old friend. being calm, uh, kind, kind. Nothing to do with the fact that it. That... Is she? Or just? Um. Maybe this is why I get these uncontrollable urges to never remove things from my, um, from my to-do list. So that I get this urge to complete the to-do list. And is she not beginning to wonder why I'm... She's probably thinking, he's warming up after... She locked me in! She hasn't... You don't think it's some... Vicious ruse, do you? Lure strangers in and then trap them and eat them. Could be. Okay. Um, yes, um, so yes, uh, have a nice day. Well, no, uh, my condolences on your loss. I hope things get slightly better for you and that nobody ever robs you again. You know, I'm not even totally sure what possessed me. Hey, Steed, remember who is in charge here? There's some fighting back there. I'm not even sure what possesses me to take things like that. They don't even look particularly valuable. Um. Cornemuse. I mean, I don't even know what it is, but there's something about it that says. There's probably a place for it in your museum. It's probably one of the mysteries of the universe, like why on earth I get these urges to tell people random things that I just don't care about. Because I, I happen to find a body and a note on it, I get this urge to tell, well, it's not even an urge. I get the urge 
to write it in my journal. And then this uncontrollable urge to cross it off my journal as done. You know, having a to-do list is a very dangerous thing. But as I've just pointed out, it's also a thing that leads me to odd little... I don't even know what to call that. It wasn't a trinket. I don't even know what it is. It's a pipe. Is it an instrument? Is it is it is it a is it a tool for doing something? Is it a way to smoke strange substances? I mean I just I do not know what on earth that is. Right. First thing. Let's go and say hi to the guys, and now I suddenly realise I should have spent a little extra time getting that job done in Whiterun. I just didn't think I'd be coming here anytime soon. I ch never mind, never mind. I've, I've still got lots of jobs to uh, report. I've completed the fishing job. A pleasure, as always, boss. Here's your payment. Is this place looking a little lighter? I feel like you've brightened the place up a little. I don't know why. Normally I feel like I have to get a torch out to even speak to you. Um Bloody good timing. Just got some more clients. That's me. Bloody good timing. That is it should be my middle name, or it would be if I had a second. Well actually I do have a I'm I'm Leonard Septim, aren't I? Leonard just in bloody time Septim. Uh, do you have any fishing jobs? Wait, wants this mark's head on a pike, but we'll settle for what the bastards carry it instead. Can I care on you? Of course you can. Don't ask silly questions. Great. Watch yourself out there, boss. Oh, right. And... Yes, my Did you need something? Vex! Yes, oh, you made it. Good to see you, my friend. I'll never forget how you saved my life from those yeah, Talmor maniacs. Thank you for the visit. Oh, hello! It's not that bright, is it? I am. Um, yes. Need something? Yes, I saved you. Good afternoon. Do you have any water? Oh, I actually do need to refill my water, but again, I've learned my lesson no, from that one. I'm going to stick with asking innkeeps. Hello, I Vex. The master graces me with a visit. What can I do for you? I want to pay you, but I had to cover up the murder. I didn't expect you to go on a killing spree. What? What killing spree? What? Killing spree! If it was that work, was in solitude. That job was in solitude. It was absolutely perfect. Is this because of the dragon? Is this because of the dragon? Because the only people that died while I was in solitude died to a dragon. That was not my fault and had nothing to do with the job. I need Guildmaster graces me with a visit. I've completed the shield job. You did the job and you did it clean. Okay, that's well, we that's a ask. bloody Which relief. <sighs> I've completed the heist job as well. Amazing what people leave laying around for us to Okay, so you're not going to accuse me of murdering everyone in that one. All right, fine. That's really annoying. Bark and sap the seven flights of the Alduduga. Flight six. Okay, interesting. I don't think I've got anything to sell you, Moors. The oh, you know what? See, I don't know if I need that. That's the big problem. I don't know if I need any of that. So, honestly, I I don't think I've got. Summon Daedra up to level ten and put under the wearer's control. I don't even know if I need the enchantment or that. I just do not know if I if I if I've got anything to sell you. So, Hi. sorry. My apologies. I usually like to sell her a Good few things. Brief. No, it's very dark over here. And let's see if they've been... Uh... <sighs> really? They're still just... <sighs> Honestly, these guys are... really slacking. Where's... Inigo. Inigo. He sometimes gets a little distracted when we're down here. It's been a while. I was there to 
to say it's been a while since I sweet rolled Riften, but apparently somebody else has had the same idea. I'm guessing that is an incompetent thief learning a hard lesson. Let's not make the same mistakes. We're going to start here by um, making sure we've got a long lasting night vision potion. Okay, I get the feeling I need a key for this chest. Oh, it's not their chest. You know, it may have been a while since I've sweet rolled this place, but they haven't restocked in a long time. No sign of them. Okay. Did I hear more combat? Was that thief still? Sneaking around. That might explain why I'm not finding very much. Stuff tonight. Maybe there's been a few other thieves running around and they're just tripping over each other. Oh, well, I've definitely got something I want to get from here. Sweet rolls, either. Apple pie sounds nice, but it's not quite the same. Let's check all the drawers. Okay. Now. I don't want to lose track of time. That's the official job I've got here. All the running around is making me very nervous. I don't want to lose track of time. The main event, of course, is the palace. I just uh, need to leave myself enough time to go there. And that. Yep. You're an embarrassment to the uniform. So, Bercy has a skooma problem. I can't remember if I knew that. I should probably have a little book of interesting things to know. Just in case, for example, the fact that they haven't cleaned this urn up yet. So there was a second one. There was an actual second one who stole pots and pans. Good grief. Argonian ceremony. Dinya. I was wondering if you could speak to Madame Al about perhaps presiding over a marriage ceremony for myself and Kariva. She's the love of my life and I wish to be with her forever, but only if we can be wed in traditional Argonian fashion. Traditional Argonian bonding ceremonies are somewhat long and complex, involving unique rituals spoken in our native language. I'd be more than happy to provide a book describing what I'm looking for as long as Madame Al doesn't mind. Jalantai. Okay. And a kiss sweet mother right next to it. Memo to self, if I ever want to get married, don't ask anyone in this temple to perform the ceremony. Okay. 
19 out of 20. Oh, I've still got five more to go. I am never going to find all of them. Twelve thousand eight hundred and twelve. Okay, that's the money I gave her for enchanting, isn't it? Oh, there is no chance whatsoever that I can steal twelve thousand coins. She must be lying on it. The entire mattress must be stuffed with it. Oh, that is. That is my money. <sighs> okay. Don't want to lose the invisibility here. Um. <sighs> okay, focus, 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 focus on what you're here for. We'll. Okay, which way was the steward? Which way was the steward? It was you. Okay. Right. What am I looking for? I'm looking for some evidence. The city. They're not going to come in here. They are not going to come in here. Did she have this evidence on her? Possibly. Confiscated goods key. I don't think this is what I'm here for. No, it's not. So what am I here for then? I'm just going to absolutely remind myself. Find the evidence. Um... As Lila Lawgiver Stewart, she might be able to provide important information and assets. Investigate the possibility of black. Was it this? This was. I've read this. A quick note regarding my son, Sibby. He's to be treated as I'd expect you treat any one of the Black Briar family, and all of his requests are to be honoured without question. However, if he wishes to be released, you are not to do so unless I expressly authorise it. Sibby needs to learn his place, and the only way that will happen is if he's kept under lock and key. Okay, it's not that. It is not that. All right. No, that's definitely not. Oh, letter incriminating a Nuriel. Okay, what does it say? Oh. Dearest Anuriel, the Jarl has shown great wisdom in showing you as her steward, a position well befitting your character, as it demands great cunning grace, and shall we say, a talent for performing one's duties tactfully and discreetly. You've become an important asset to our operation. I trust you found the dress accompanying this letter to your satisfaction. Remember, as I flourish, so too will my friends. However, I wish to remind you of your pledge to prevent Honing Brew deliveries from entering the city. I'm also still awaiting for the detachment of city guards to escort my merchandise. I understand it can take time navigating around delicate sensibilities of your mistress, the great Lila Lawgiver. But really, I've waited long enough. Provided you continue to serve my interests, I will continue to look after yours. I trust I'll be hearing from you soon, Maven. Okay. You know what? She's sort of working in our interests, sort of. Maven and I, you know... Well, Maven doesn't really need to know this, does she? Blackmail and Nuriel. Okay. Anuriel. Welcome to Mistvale Keep. I'm Jarl Layla's steward, Anuriel. Do you recognize the outfit? I am from a certain guild, and I have come to remind you of a certain deal you have. I suppose you're here to extort something from me? Is that it? 
No, 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 no. Well, what is it you want? We, we want you to, uh, yeah, the, the, you rebels are doing a fine job of destroying yourselves. Soldiers running errands. So, you're an Imperial spy. Yes. Interesting. I have no strong love for the Stormcloaks, but I can't say I'm all that fond of the Empire, either. This war of yours makes it difficult for a resourceful woman to advance her interests. Perhaps we can find a way for both of us to prosper from this unfortunate discovery? Uh, what kind of agreement did you have in mind? What if I told you about a large shipment of gold and weapons? Uh... Go on. Oh no, I'm no fool. You'll learn what you need to know once we've come to an agreement. And what about something for me right now? Yes, 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 yes. Well, I... Will give I me what I want. I suppose I'm not left much choice in the matter, am I? No, but keep your voice down. Very well. I trust a hefty purse of septums will suffice? It helps, definitely. Okay, so... How much are we talking about, by the way? Enough to make a significant difference in the war. Okay. All right, it's a deal. Where can I find the shipment? They're taking it by wagon to Windhelm. If you hurry, you'll catch them before they get far. It'll be a fairly slow-moving caravan. The shipment is quite heavy and guarded by many men. Uh, now, let's pretend we never had this discussion. Right, okay. Um, so there's... You're welcome in Riften, as long as you continue to obey our laws. I just snuck into your bedroom in the middle of the night, wearing a thieves outfit, and blackmailed you. I mean, at this point, what rules are you expecting me to actually obey? Good manners? Don't belch at the dinner table? 